76ers. At point guard, Kyle Lowry. At small forward, Kelly Oubre Jr. At forward, Tobias Harris. Reese Maxi. At center, Joel B. The head coach of the visiting team, Nick Nurse. Sixers starting group. Harrison and Bede are in the middle. Tyrese Maxey is out there with Kyle Lowry. And it's Oubre in at the three. And for the Knicks, we've got Mitchell Robinson. Achua is out there with OG Ananobi. Then there's Jalen Brunson. And it's Steven Chenzo in at the shooting guard position. You take a look at the Knicks. They had a great season and are expected to control their destiny in this series. I'll tell you what, it'd be a shock if they didn't run through this series. With that said, we know anything can happen in the postseason. Pass to Oubre. Here's Embiid. And he buries his first look. And that's the hunger that Embiid plays with. He just gobbles up the miss and goes back up for the score. Here's the Chua. It in off the glass. Yeah, attack mode from the start. Exactly what you want coming into this game. Get to the right guy, get a high percentage look, and that's the kind of game they want to play tonight. Kept alive. Here's Embiid. Here's Harris. That one's good for two. Yeah, the passing has only gotten better from Embiid. It adds a huge element to his game. Vincenzo against Maxi. And it's blocked by Embiid. Lowry, the pass to Embiid. And that comes Joel off the Embiid. assist by Lowry. That's from You're going to have to do a Tyler lot more Lowry. than that to stop Joel Embiid. Brunson finds DiVincenzo. And it'll be on the wing. He's covered by Oubre. Five on the clock. Here's Brunson, and it's good. Off the back rim and in. Now, this is what makes Jalen Brunson special. You've got to knock down contested shots. Mr. Brunson up to the task. Achua against Harris. Outside Oubre. Again, Philadelphia. The assist. The Knicks have gone two of three from the floor. Pass to Ananobi. 
And just under two and a half minutes elapsed here in the first. And there's the foul. It's on Joel and B. That's his first foul. Time called here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. And a big round of applause for your next city hit. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. And an Obi on the take. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. Kevin Oubre Jr. First personal foul. Second team foul. OG Anunobi at the line. Ooh, one shot. One shot. And an Obi, no good on the free throw. Well, the more opportunity that is given to OG and Obi, the more the shot man shines. He is a multi-dimensional talent. Gives you great defense nightly and growing on the offensive end. Brunson looks it over. Rejected by Harris. The sneaky 6-8. Harris putting his length to use. Outside, DiVincenzo. Six on the shot clock. Throws it up high. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt. Well, the consistency with which Kyle Lowry involves his teammates is really a sight to behold. This guy's such a good passer. Here's Brunson. Carries it down low. Brunson's got his second basket on the night. I love this approach. Getting him involved early and is already paying off. They know that if this guy goes off, their chances of winning rise exponentially. Pretty dime there. The kind of ball movement coaches love to see. And here's Brunson from the arc. Hits the trifecta. Brunson's got seven points in the game. And so it's Maxi with it. He brings it up to the 76er. Harris passes to Maxi. Count it. One for one to start the game. Well, that's a nice play. You've got to read the situation and go to your floater game when necessary. Kicks it out to Ananobi. And again, New York with the triple. OG Ananobi increasingly dangerous with his jumper. Nice catch and shoot opportunity there. Lowry, the pass to Embiid. The basket counts. Impressive. Their ball movement has been excellent tonight. A chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for Philadelphia. They've done a great job establishing an inside presence. Now that'll open up more options offensively throughout the remainder of the game. Yeah, and what an excellent display of passing in the early stages of this game. A good deal of their points coming directly off quality passes. They're one of the most well-rounded players in the game. Embiid is also a top-notch trash talker, too. I mean, he knows how to get under the skin of his opponents. And a big finish by and both teams already firing on all cylinders. Yeah, this is already a high-scoring game, but we knew that was a possibility coming into this one. Now here's Lowry, Embiid, and count that! Two points and a chance for one more in the line. They're finding ways to get the ball to the paint. Five consecutive buckets.
free throw drops for Embiid. And here are the Knicks now. Four-point game. And here's Brunson from the arc. Oh, my goodness! He'll go to the line with a chance on a four-point play. That'll belong to Kyle Lowry. First personal foul. Third team foul. Jalen Brunson at the line. Oh, one shot. That free throw good from Brunson. Well, because Jalen Brunson's such a terrific decision maker, you can tell how confident and comfortable this team is when he runs the offense. Harris outside. And Embiid gets the double team. Clock at six. And there is the whistle. That goes on Tobias Harris. That's his first foul of the game. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. New York has gone three of three from outside and looking sharp here in the first. Here's Brunson. Hey, in six attempts, he's made five. Talk about efficiency. Only one miss in his first six shots. He's definitely brought his A game. And the 76ers call time here. Lots to talk about here, guys. I mean, losing momentum and looking for answers. I think here you have just got to get back to what you do best and then live with the results. So it's Maxi who brings up the ball for the Philadelphia 76ers. Trailing by two. Here's Embiid. Again gets it to go. He can't miss. Five for five. Off to a great start. Five straight from the field. Outside Ananobi. Yeah, imposing his will and beat sending a message with that rejection. You gotta appreciate the consistency. Night in and night out. Brings it to pass to Embiid. Robinson against Maxi. Here he goes. Oh, what a finish in traffic! My goodness! We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. And here's Achua. No one near him. Boy, oh, clanks that one off the back iron and it falls. Achua's got his second bucket of the game. That's just outstanding floor awareness for Jalen Brunson. Doesn't matter who's at the one or the two. He always makes the right play. Embiid finds Harris. Good. And the assist to Embiid. And the 76ers lead by one. Defensively, you have to stay connected to him on the perimeter. New York calls timeout. Boy, you look at Joel Embiid. He's playing really well right now. Boy, he's been relentless. And to this point, they haven't had an answer for him on the inside. Let's see if they make some adjustments coming out of the timeout. Here for New York. 
Hardenstein. He's checked in for Robinson. Boyan Bogdanovich. He comes in for Achua. Hart's checked in for Ananobi. And it's Burks in for DiVincenzo. Heald's checked in for the Sixers. Payne comes in for Lowry. Here's Hardenstein. Here's Brunson. Up and in on the layup. Brunson's got 15. This guy is cooking right now. He is leading them on the offensive end as they remain in front here. Embiid passes to Heald. Harris outside. And the 76ers, another three. Now this guy has made giant strides in his playmaking. Nice setup by Buddy Heald right there. Back to Brunson. He gets it. He's seven for eight and really going at him out there. Of his eight shots so far, he's only missed one. <laughs> he's starting this game strong. From 13, here's Harris. Got it. Makes him four for six from the floor. What an aggressive mindset in this period. He's starting to take over. Burks with it. Picked up by Embiid. And there's the foul. It's on Joel Embiid. That'll be a second foul of the game. Brunson passes to Hart. Basket is good. Off the assist from Brunson. How about the time? It could be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Nice delivery. Pass to Embiid. Down low. Shot from the low post is good. 12 points for him. And he's carried them this quarter. A dominant offensive stretch. Outside Hart. Here's Hardenstein. Embiid covers. Outside Bogdanovich. Oh, Harris with the block. In transition. Maxi with it. Now Burks defending. And he hits it and gets hacked. A three-point chance here if he can convert. A little relish, a little extra to that. Finish the double clutch before laying it in. Reed's checked in for MB. New York trailing. Burks passes to Hartenstein. And it's New York with another. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. It takes an incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. Now here's Payne. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. Just breathe. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. And the 76ers lead by five. Brunson passes to Bogdanovich. Back to Brunson. Outside Bogdanovich. Pass to Burks. Six to shoot. Shot from 12. And it's New York scoring again. Beautiful touch from Burks. He excels at knocking down these mid-range shots. Here's Maxi. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Maxi's got nine points. By every time he goes up now, it just looks like the shot's going in. He's perfect from the field in this quarter. There's Bogdanovich with the three. Yes, and a nice assist from Brunson. Brunson's got three assists now in this one. 76ers lead. 41. Maxi on the wing, defended by Burks. Maxi, that's good. 11 points in the game. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. And Burks gets it to go. Boy, remarkable watching Alan Burks power through the defense. 36 seconds left in the first quarter here. It's deflected, and they get it back. Drops in the three. Well, he's been shooting it so well because he's been so active, moving and working to get high percentage shots. Here's Brunson, and it's New York scoring again. Well, I'm telling you, this guy is doing everything he can to get them where they want to be. He's been on a mission in this period. Maxi against Burks. Fires, top of the key. The shot no good. And for him, that's a great look. Expect him to go right back to it if it's available. Well, no doubt. Very good play call, good execution. Sometimes it just doesn't fall. It's been all about Tobias Harris for the 76ers.
hitting three trays in the quarter, providing some sharp shooting. We'll be right back. back into it here in game one. All right, guys, what's your take on the Sixers so far? Well, coming into tonight, maybe you thought they were going to settle for perimeter jump shots. <laughs> nope, that's not the case. Uh, they've certainly made the commitment to pounding the basketball into the painted area, and boy, is it paying dividends. New York has gone four or five from outside the arc in this one. They've got Jalen Brunson. Achua is out there with OG Ananobi. Then it's Dante DiVincenzo, and it's Hart in at the three. That's the five for New York right now. Now here's Lowry, still without a bucket. And he lobs it up top! Oubre can't hit. Got the ball where he wanted it, but then got swarmed. Here's Brunson, and Reed pulls it down. Philadelphia has gone three of five from the perimeter in this game. Here's Lowry. Uses the glass on the layup. And the 76ers lead by five. He drops yet another dive. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Here's Brunson. It's tipped. Kyle Lowry does so many things well on the basketball floor, but always, always the foundation of his game is that tenacity defensively. Jalen Brunson at the line. Two shots. Shooting two. And he drops it first. Mitchell Robinson, he's checked in for Hart. Harris is checked in for the Sixers. Free throws. Good from Brunson. Here in the second quarter. A little over a minute of play. Pass to Reed. Back to Lowry. And they get it back. Wingspan. Athleticism. Anthony verticality. Martin. Robinson with authority sends it back. And they're doing strong work on the glass. A plus five advantage for them. Now here's DiVincenzo. And that one's good. That makes him two for three. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point blank range. Pass to Melton. Shoots over DiVincenzo. And again, it's Philadelphia. Second quarter of play with around two minutes gone so far. Outside, DiVincenzo. Yes, and a nice assist from Brunson. Brunson's got four assists now tonight. I'll tell you, he'll take that all day, every day. I'm sure he was shocked to find himself that wide. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. Oubre's got eight. And so it's Brunson who brings up the ball for New York. It's a five-point game. Deflected! And he gets it back. And Jalen Brunson gets the whistle that time. That'll be a second foul of the game. To a certain extent, you like the aggressiveness, but that's two fouls already. Take a step back. The 76ers have gone four for six here in the second. Reed passes to Lowry. That's tipped. Pass to Achua. Here's the three. And again, New York with the triple. What you see is continued improvement in his ability to create for others. Great to see OG Ananobi make the open read. Lowry. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Jalen Brunson picks one up. It was a strong move. First the shot's just a little off. Kyle Lowry at the line. Two shots.
That free throw good from Lowry. Maybe the most defining aspect of Kyle Lowry's career has been that competitive spirit. This guy has got vision, scoring ability, but he's always been team first. The Knicks making a switch here. Burks has checked in. Both free throws good from Lowry. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Pass to Ananobi. Oh, he nails that one. Three for four now. I'll tell you, it's six foot eight with the elite athleticism. Good luck checking OG Ananobi on the interior. Harris finds Lowry. And there's the lob. Beautiful setup on the alley oop. Great catch, great flush. New York has gone two for two from the arc here in the second. The ball's knocked loose. He's got a clear path. Rips down the breakaway slam. And that's what happens when you don't take care of the ball. Hey, that makes the turnover hurt even more. At the end of the day, though, it's two points. Don't hang your heads. Let's get refocused and play with more patience. Second team foul. Outside Ananobi. Pass to DiVincenzo. Here's Robinson. And they pick up two. Robinson's got the second bucket. Well, you want Mitchell Robinson to finish with strength and authority. He does there. Works against Melton. Reed using his post moves to get the two points. Gotta show more strength on the low block to keep him out of position. Well, it's a couple of things here, I think. Certainly the effort, the willingness to fight, and the willingness to push him off of his comfort zone. The 76ers have gotten seven of their first nine shots to drop during the second. Pass to Oubre. And the call will be against Kelly Oubre. That's foul number two for him. A great job to establish position and square up. The Knicks have gotten six of ten shots to drop in the second. Nice work. Here's Burks. Goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. Now just a two-point Philadelphia lead. This is not an easy cover. Alex Burks incredibly aggressive down inside. Harris against Achua. The shot is good. Harris has got 17 points. New York has got six of seven threes to fall. They're looking solid out there. Burks finds Achua. Back to Burks. He's got it. Four for four now. He's automatic. Well, you love the cleverness of Alec Burks. My goodness, how remarkable is that? Here's Harris. And the shot goes in. Harris has got 19 points. The Knicks have gotten 8 of 12 attempts to drop since the beginning of the second. Burks passes to DiVincenzo. DiVincenzo on the wing. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Second personal foul. Third team foul. Dante DiVincenzo. At the line, two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That free throw no good from DiVincenzo for the Knicks. Hardenstein, he's checked in for Robinson. And Bogdanovich is subbed in for Achua. Both free throws good from DiVincenzo. Getting themselves to the line this quarter is a good way to get their offense rolling. Has to read. Outside Maxi. And here's another one for the Sixers. Unselfishness can be infectious. Terrific teamwork. Pass to Ananobi. Back to DiVincenzo. Rebound by the 76ers. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the board. Maxi finds heel. With the teardrop. Yep, that one goes. Heald's gotten his first bucket of the night. Boy, soft touch from Heald on the floater. I didn't know he had that in his game. 
and DiVincenzo with the basket on the assist by Burks. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Maxi, that's good. Reese Maxi. New York trailing. Outside Bogdanovich. And the Knicks, another three. Boy, Bogdanovich with the distance delivery. How about that effortless shooting motion? Pass to heel. Harris outside. Three pointer. Another three for Philadelphia. Yeah, he's in his bag from beyond the arc right now. You see his confidence. And I think the defender knows once he gets cooking, look out. The bucket looks awfully big to him right now. Well, individually, he is doing everything he can in this 12-minute session, but he's just not getting enough help. And Maxi, here we go. Shoot from 12, and he sinks out. He's hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Maxi's got six here in the quarter. Now a timeout called by New York. Tobias Harris really making a difference here. Well, I think this is a necessary timeout so they can figure out a way to limit the impact this guy's having from three-point range. They've got to dedicate more resources to their perimeter D. Also making a switch. Joel Embiid, he's checked in for Reed. Pass to DiVincenzo. Back to Hart. Bogdanovich on the wing. Misses the three. I'll tell you what, they've been aggressive and they've been physical. A shot by Payne, no good. New York has gone seven of nine from three point range so far. Here's DiVincenzo. That's basket number six in eight tries. And now almost all their points coming from the paint. 78, 74. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. It's on Alec Burks. Second team foul. Tyrese Maxey at the line. Two shots. Free throws good for Maxi. Zero wasted trips. They're doing their job at the line. And the Knicks making a change here. Brunson's checked in. Both free throws good from Maxi. This is about the last guy you want to send to the strike right now. They keep fouling him and he keeps making them. Outside Bogdanovich. Get it again. It's good. And he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play opportunity. Fourth personal foul. Reeves checked in for Philadelphia. Isaiah Hartenstein at the line. One shot. And that one misses. Philadelphia's got five of seven threes to drop here tonight. Payne against Brunson. Deflects the pass. It's stolen by Hart. Now here's Bogdanovich. He's closely guarded. And he gets it to go. 
Bogdanovich has got five points now this quarter. Bogdanovich, such a nice offensive arsenal. He is capable of scoring from anywhere. And here's Payne outside. Philadelphia, the rebound. Healed from outside. That falls. Nice set up by Harris. Healed's got five now. That right there, that's the kind of look this system is designed to create. Hart passes to DiVincenzo. Brunson against Payne. And it's New York with another. Jalen Brunson right now attacking without hesitation. His foot is on the gas pedal. Payne, pass to Maxi. Heel to the ball. And the 76ers, another three. Well, deliver the pass where your teammate can do something with it. Nice. Back to Brunson. Sneak it inside. It's Brunson. Yeah, don't be fooled by the height, guys. Brunson is a terrific finisher inside. Harris outside. Got a hand on it. Six-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Outside Brunson. Back to DiVincenzo. Ooh, now seven for nine after that make. How about that well-timed drop-off? Jalen Brunson just knows where to put the basketball. Tipped away, and it's out of bounds. The Sixers able to retain possession here. DiVincenzo with the steal. With four on the clock. And it's good on the lay-in. DiVincenzo's got 19 points. And a steal like that with the conversion can really start moving things in your direction. And the first half comes to a close in a tie game. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? 86. I'm here with Coach Tom Thibodeau, and Coach, you battled back from that early deficit. What changed for this team? Well, we played better defense, and then we were able to get good shots, quality shots, but we have to play defense. I know you pride yourself on that area of the game. Thanks, Coach. Allie, as always, thank you. We'll be back right after the break for the third quarter here on 2K Sports. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. And a heightened atmosphere we have here this evening for NBA playoff action. Hey, everybody, I'm Ernie Johnson. Got Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith by my side. Checking out New York. They've hung tough in what was a closely contested first half. If what we've seen in game one so far is any indication, we're going to have quite a series on our hands. Taking a look at the Knicks, Kenny, what'd you think? Most of the damage they're doing is in the paint. They've made a concerted effort to work the ball and shot to create options. And that could open up the perimeter for them in the second half with the D worried about the post. Shaq, what do you think about Philadelphia? Well, I thought the one bright spot was the effort on the glass. Several times when momentum was sliding, getting the tiny rebound really lifted it. The strong work on the glass is key because that's how you string together a series of big stops. And that's all we have for now. Tell the folks goodbye, Shaq. Tell the folks Here goodbye, goodbye. Kenny. Goodbye. Go to Kevin Harlan. And thanks for sticking with us as this round one game continues. You look at Jalen Brunson. What a contribution. And if he felt any pressure coming into this game, he sure hasn't shown it. What a sensational start. Boy, he has been locked in, all about business, just going out there and doing what he does best. Thanks for joining us again for round one of the NBA playoffs. Taking a look at Philadelphia. Harrison Embiid are in the middle. Kyle Lowry out there with Tyrese Maxey. And it's Oubre in at the three slot. Philadelphia has gone 7 of 11 from outside the arc. Nice percentage from distance so far. Oh, got that one up quick. Oubre's got 10 points in the game. Now the extreme confidence on display by Oubre. Knocking it down with the D in his grill. Now here's Brunson. Achua finds Ananobi. Back to Achua. Shot clock at 6. And Ananobi. 
Kobe gets it to go. Nine points in the game. These defenders really need to man up, particularly in the lane. Chua against Maxi. And denied! He sends it right off the glass. 76ers foul. Tobias Harris. Second personal foul. First team foul. Dante DiVincenzo. At the line, two shots. Can't get the first one. And the 76ers making a change here. Reed's checked in. And that one drops. So now they lead by one. He does enough to give them the lead. Every point critical here with the game in the balance. Lowry, the pass to Reed. Pass to Oubre. Shoots over Ananobi. He got a piece of it. OG Ananobi is fast off his feet. Seven foot two wingspan. Says twice on the pipes. Here's Brunson. Oh, the agility of Brunson getting to the bucket. He's got a knack for finishing inside. That's easy, but now here's Harris. Back to Maxi. Pass to Reed. Got a piece of it. Robinson with a steal. Left side, DiVincenzo. Robinson passes to Brunson. Here's Achua. From down in the low post, it goes. Now it's a five-point New York lead. Maxi passes to Harris. To halt the run. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. It's going to go on Mitchell Robinson. Well, that was clearly a foul. At the line, two shots. He throws good from Maxi. And that's good as he hits both shots. The Knicks have gotten three or four shots to fall so far in the third. Lowry against Brunson. Brunson inside with the finish. <laughs> They're just taking what the defense gives them. And right now, that's the interior. Here's Harris. And the basket is good. Harris has got 24. In so many ways, Harris can beat you. He has the size and skill to score from all three levels. Pass to Achua. Fades away, and it's Harris with the rebound. The 76ers have gone 2 of 5 in this third quarter. We're beginning to see this more and more from Harris, just taking what the defense allows, and that time finding a wide open man. Now Ananobi. Back to Brunson. Over Lowry. A sturdy finish from Brunson. They have no answer defensively inside. Pass to Maxi for the tie. That shot is off. Well, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Here's Brunson. Good on the 13 footer. And it's a five point Nick lead. That's 10 straight points they've given up in the painted area. Huh. Timeout called. The 76ers. You look at Jalen Brunson. What a contribution. Boy, much needed timeout. This guy scoring and will, and they've had no answer.
checked in for DiVincenzo. The 76ers also with a sub. Melton's checked in. The Sixers trailing. Pass to Reed. Back to Lowry. Outside Oubre. He tries for three. That's good. And so Lowry with the assist. Lowry's got assist number seven tonight. Here's Brunson. Goes up and lays it in. Nice and easy. Brunson's got ten points in the quarter. I love this game. That's ten points in a row for McClough. And it's in there. Well, the tenacity of the play by Kyle Lowry pushes through the contact and scores it. Brunson passes to Robinson. Right side, Ananobi. And he gets the bucket. Ananobi's got 11. Their defense just falls apart once the ball goes inside. Pass to Oubre. Beyond the arc. And it's Brunson with the rebound. And Brunson's got the ball here for the Knicks. They lead by four. And Ananobi gets it to go. Their interior D continues to look shaky. Not a good matchup for them right now. Pass to Oubre. He drops it from range. 16 points for him. After doing nothing from beyond the arc in the first half, he has turned things around. Now Brunson. Given 35. Oh, wow! A bomb from Brunson. Well, all night he has made an impact at the offensive end. He's trying to shut the door. Harris with it. It's Robinson picking him up. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Robinson. Josh Hart's checked in for New York. Embiid, he's checked in for the Sixers. Heel comes in for Harris. to Embiid. Shoots over Robinson. And there's Embiid. That one's good. And the assist from Lowry. Without missing a beat, Embiid gets the shot up. And that's the work of an assertive offensive player. For three, Lowry. Another three for Philadelphia. This defense just can't stay connected to shooters. Lowry against Brunson. Outside Hart. And he's going for the lob. Robinson gets the bucket. Robinson's got six. I'll tell you, a level of toughness on display for Mitchell Robinson. Send the message, young sir. Pass to Lowry. Here's Oubre. Just five to shoot. Shoots over Aminobi. And Oubre gets it to go. Junior. Oubre's got 10 points here in the second half. Boy, it seems like every shot he puts up, it's going in. This guy is hot, hot. And Anobi can't get it to go. Boy, a little indecisive. I think he wanted to kick it out, changed his mind, and ended up missing. And after getting smoked earlier in this game, they battled back to take the lead. Let's get a quick check of the scoring breakdown here for Philadelphia. Well, you love their unselfish play. Keeping that ball moving, Good shot to great. That's winning basketball. Boy, the long ball has been another point of emphasis for this group tonight. Their shooters are finding open spaces and firing without hesitation. That's good from Heel. For a guy with the shot mechanics of Buddy Heel, you'd love to see him get to the free throw line more. But it's really not his game. He is just a dead-eye three-point shooter. And now the Sixers on the break. And here's Oubre from the arc. Cash. He's 9 for 14 in the game. He's looked like a totally different player in the second half. That's his third triple. Hart with it. Picked up by Embiid. And the foul called on Buddy Heal. That's his first foul of the game. And the Knicks making a change here. DiVincenzo's checked in. Into the lineup for your New York Knicks. Dante DiVincenzo. Brunson finds Hart. Back to Brunson. Six to shoot. Oh, Brunson with the floater. He's done everything he can to give them a lift tonight, but it hasn't been enough. It's blocked. Pass 
to DiVincenzo. Back to Brunson. Hardenstein passes to Brunson. Over Payne. Ooh, a tough get from JP. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. And here's Oubre. Pass to Embiid. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Embiid's got four points this quarter. Flat out dominant. Joel Embiid having his way tonight. Brunson, another one falls for New York. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. It takes an incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. He had more than enough room to hit that. He just couldn't make it happen. Count the basket and the foul! Man, it's going to go on Cameron Payne. They are trying to close this out strong, and he's the man who put you in this position. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for the Knicks. Yeah, they've done a great job of challenging every shot they can. Their totals in the block column are a result of that aggression. I think it's also important we have to acknowledge how many scoring opportunities they've created from their spectacular defense, getting a bunch of points off turnovers. Philadelphia has gone four of seven from three, a good percentage in the third quarter. Outside paint. Ooh, a little luck that time as it drops. Even if they saw the step back coming, the defense didn't offer much resistance. DiVincenzo, pass to Hart. Here's Brunson. Solid shot from a distance of about 14 feet. Brunson's got 49 in the game. Pass to Embiid. Takes a 13-footer. And here's another one for the Sixers. Yeah, this is what sets Embiid apart from other bigs. That mid-range game is on point. And got it! Another basket! And that gives him 51. Making it look easy. Melton with the ball. Inside. Embiid just brushing off the contact inside. And there's the process at work. Embiid rolls off the pick and right into scoring position. Here's Brunson. Tipped. Melton against Steven Tenzo. Yes, it's good. Melton's got nine. <laughs> they are passing the ball around tremendously right now. Five-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Outside Bogdanovich. Over Oubre. He hits the back iron and sinks it. Ten points for him. Well, Bogdanovich looking so comfortable close to the rim. Just extends past the defense beautifully. From deep, Melton. Oh, and he just knocked down the buzzer beater. A huge three allows him to snatch the lead heading into the final quarter. That takes us to the end of the third quarter. What a game. Neither team giving ground. Sixers ahead. They're up by three. And we're coming back in just a moment. Get ready for the fourth quarter when we return. And we take a listen in now to Tom Thibodeau on a recent huddle. That's too easy down there. It's too easy. Keep the ball in front. Challenge shots. Long rebound. Mark. And defense is important to Coach Thibodeau. And he's not seeing it from his squad right now. Yeah, it's lackluster. And you know that's never going to sit well with Coach Tibbs. Great to have you with us again as we return to our coverage of round one. We've got Dante DiVincenzo. Precious Achua is out there with Mitchell Robinson. Then it's Josh Hart. And it's Brunson in at the one spot. That's the five for New York right now. Brunson misses. The Sixers leading. Maxi passes to Embiid. Healed on the wing. Back to Melton. The three ball. Another three for Philadelphia. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. So it's Philadelphia now. Following the bucket by the Knicks. From deep, Melton. He gets 
it. He's seven for eight and really going at him out there. After hitting only one from downtown in the first half, he's exploded with three cents. Robinson passes to DiVincenzo. Right side, Brunson. Shoots over Melton. And again. And he's been dominant so far in this one. Shouldering the offense. Really taking it to the opposition. Pass to Melton. Back to Maxi. It falls. And now he's 10 of 15 shooting. Nice work. Absolutely ruthless. He's not about to start showing mercy now. Well, when it's closing time, he's trying to lock the door. He's been going all night. Achua can't hit. Excellent job of closing out on that three. It may be the hardest thing to do in basketball. Close under control, and he's more than up to the task. Heel to the ball, and it's Robinson picking him up. Buddy heels so active on the offensive end. Finds the defense in a compromised position and gets what he's looking for. At the line, two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. If they keep hitting free throws at this clip, it'll help them seal the deal. And Anobi, he's checked in for Hart. Lowry, he's checked in for Philadelphia. Hits them both. And if you're just joining us, fourth quarter here. We're just over two and a half minutes into it. Time yeah. called here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. Coach really needs to get his guys fired up in attacking the glass. They're not putting up much of a fight. Here and it's led to way too many second chance shots. For your Knicks, Penny Dancer. Thanks, guys. I was able to hear Tom Thibodeau coaching his team during that last break. He told them, quote, if we'd worked harder on the glass, we'd probably be up right now. Show some heart. Show some pride. It was a very direct message. Back to you guys. Okay, good stuff. Thank you, Allie. Yeah, just doing his part. Staying active and converting at a high rate. And he has really kept them in this one. The high effort level. Now the rest of the team has got to step up. Maxi, that's good. And he's just crushing them with plays like that. I mean, just continuing to pile it on. You want to make sure your opponent knows they have absolutely zero chance of a comeback. And nice finish by him. Now here's Brunson. Outside Ananobi. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot. And will go to the line. Second place, no foul. First team foul. OG Akinobi at the line. One shot. That free throw is good from Ananobi. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Pass to Harris. Now here's Maxi. Now indeed, Robinson defending. Ananobi against Lowry. Shoots from the right block. And the play by Ananobi as he finishes. What you appreciate is OG Ananobi's detailed and patient offensive approach. Simply taking what the defense gives him. Embiid finds Lowry. 
with it. A truer defender. Clock at six. He blocks it again. A defensive stalwart so cool. far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. Here's Heald. New York has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. DiVincenzo, pass to Robinson. DiVincenzo against Maxi. Out of bounds. It'll be Philadelphia's ball. Listen, turnovers happen. You've got to move on to the next play. And so Lowry will bring it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. They've led by as many as 11. There's another block. Oh, you can't throw the weak sauce around him. No, you can't, B.A. I mean, he's sending everything back. Here's Brunson. Oh, the bucket's good, and he'll have a chance at one more. That'll belong to Kyle Lowry. Hey, he's doing everything he can to keep them afloat. Third person foul. Second team foul. Jalen Brunson at the line. One shot. Philadelphia has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. Timeout, Timeout call the 76ers. Protecting the rim has to be their top objective right now. And the question they're going to have to answer to me is, is it a problem with the scheme or is it a problem with matchups? Chenzo with the steal. Outside Brunson. Outside Robinson to the middle. From seven, and it's a Chua. That time on the assist from Robinson. This has been the story of the game. A battle fought on offense. And it is a major disadvantage down the stretch. You can't guard. This may just come down to who has the ball last. Now the Knicks with it. They're on a 14-6 run. Nice shot by DiVincenzo. This is the very definition of a back-and-forth contest. Yes, neither side taking its foot off the gas. I'm expecting a spectacular finish. Now here's Maxi. Ooh, nasty put back from Embiid. He's been so effective down the stretch, capitalizing on all his opportunities. Outside, DiVincenzo. The basket is good. Off the assist from Brunson. Brunson's got 10 assists here tonight. So active. To the inside, Harris. Laid it in with a nice touch off the window. Harris has got 26 points. Nothing the defense can do. Harris is just a special player, capable of beating you from all three levels. Philadelphia grabs the miss. What was he thinking? That's not within his range at all. I'm a little surprised he would even attempt that shot. Much better to swing the ball to somebody else. Gotta give him credit for jumping on the ball and making the most at the other end. Boy, inexcusable at this point of the game. They gotta be more composed in these moments. Boy, in a tight game like this, that can change the whole tone. It helps your opponent get into a little bit of a rhythm. Uneasy, too, on the layup. And now a four-point New York lead. He's delivery for his team when it matters most. To the paint. Here's Maxi. 
Ramsey. And that one is hammered home. Oh, my. That's why we had those breakaway rims. Dude, he risked pulling the whole thing down to the floor right there. Oh, stolen by Embiid. Lowry against Brunson. Lowry the pass to Maxi. Healed on the wing. Shoots over Ananobi. And the basket by Heald. Well, Buddy Heald on point from the mid-range. Don't give this guy any breathing room. And he's going for the oop here. Right side, Maxi. Oh, the go-ahead bucket, no good. That's their plan to get him an opportunity to finish in tight. That's a miss they can live with. And the shot's good. DiVincenzo's Vincenzo. got 11 points in the quarter. And this is just typical of him. They're always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. This is a player who understands when the game is hanging in the balance. He knows it's winning time. Soft touch off the glass. DiVincenzo's got 14 points here in the second half. His timing is impeccable. Red hot just as the game gets tense. And Philadelphia calls time here. It's now an opportunity to take a break and talk about their strategy moving forward. Well, there's something that the coach doesn't like. I'm curious to see which kind of adjustment he makes here. special we are witnessing a legendary performance here tonight he is like levels above everyone else on the floor something must have clicked for him in warm-ups tonight he's just come out and he has run wild Ubre, he's checked in for maxi and it goes out of bounds Last touch by Ubre. That almost looked like bad communication. You hate to see that kind of mistake. New York has gone only one of four from the perimeter here in this fourth quarter. Brunson passes to Robinson. Outside, DiVincenzo. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Harris has got four rebounds in the game. Healed on the wing. And so it looks like the Sixers will retain possession here. He had the right idea, just couldn't come up with the swipe. Yeah, the anticipation was there. The hustle was there. Very close to picking that one. Now here's Lowry from deep. And it's healed that time. All the assists from Lowry. Lowry's got assist number 11 for him here tonight. Lowry against Brunson. Pass to Achua. Five to shoot. Who poked away? Embiid with a steal. They've got numbers. Here's Heald. Yes! They get the go-ahead bucket. Heald's got 20. No hesitation whatsoever from Buddy Heald. That is a big-time delivery. Brunson against Lowry. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. 13. Jalen Brunson at the line. Two shots. He drops the first one, and that ties this game up. Jalen Brunson, a strong free throw shooter. He's knocked down big time clutch free throws before. He's got another chance. Melton, he's checked in for Philadelphia. And so he 
always good on both free throws, and that gives him a lead. Well, this is the kind of player he is. The tougher the moment, the more he elevates his game. Here's Embiid. Yes, Embiid from in close. <laughs> One thing you can say about Embiid, he never shrinks from the moment. Here's Brunson. That one doesn't drop. Philadelphia has gotten three threes to fall out of four attempts here in the fourth. Melton against Brunson. Here's Embiid. Again with the block. And that's nine blocks. And you know he's going to be coming hard for that tenth one, too. Robinson finds Brunson. Another one falls. Amazing. 60 points. This guy can't be stopped right now. They've had no answer for him in this one. Oh, deflected. And that one goes out of bounds. That last test by Robinson. Kyle Lowry's checked in for heels. Substitution. Kyle Lowry. Forty-three seconds left in the fourth. Pass to Embiid. Shot clock at five. Count it! It's been great to see guys who don't back down under pressure. To me, more often than not, when you attack, good things happen. Time called here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. They trail by one. Thirty seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, what do you think? And it would be smart to go for a two-for-one right now. been able to contain him. And Philadelphia calls time here. They trail by one. 23 seconds left in the fourth quarter. All right, guys, what's your take? It's always interesting to see what play a coach has saved for a situation like this. What you want is to create a clean, high percentage look, if that's at all possible. left in the fourth quarter of this one.
seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Lowry against Brunson. Missed it! He did everything in his power to make that a hard shot. We call that a great contest. You know this is something he brings to the table, the ability to anchor your defense. Please. So it's the 76ers taking the W in a close one. And it always takes a lot of pressure off a team when they get the win in game one. It's the most important game of the series. They've shown they know how to beat this team. The formula's in place. Now they just have to stick with it for the next few games. Well, that'll do it for now. Glad you could join us during the first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. For Allie LaForce, Doris Burke, and Grant Hill.